episode 37. We all just woke up. We're waiting for Amanda to get back from the store. She went to get the paper. We are anxiously anticipating what is in the paper about us. Are you excited, Dell? Dylan's just looking out the window waiting for mommy. This is very exciting. Not gonna lie. I may have I may have teared up a little bit while reading this article. But uh that's 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 us on the front on, on the front of this section. Look at us, we're so happy. And it's got a really cool title too. Blending of Family, one vlog at a time. How cool is that? Made the paper. Uh between meals. Laundry, homework, and Little League games with five children. You'd think Dave and Amanda Berge would have enough to do. But for one, for more than a year, the Bergies have been posting daily videos to YouTube chronicling their life as a blended family. The project began on April 21st, 2016, after Dave Berge, who did some filmmaking at Finger Lakes Community College, expressed a desire to get back into writing and movie making. His oldest son, Gavin, suggested he try his hand at a video blog. Or vlog. I think the first day I had no idea what we were doing, said Dave whose wife Amanda also was skeptical. I didn't think we would make it 14 days, she laughed, but endured they have for 402 days in a row. The daily vlog has not only drawn them closer as a family, but has attracted more than 135 subscribers, 141 now, on YouTube. The Burgies refer to their fans as Blender Blades. Dave and Amanda started dating in 2007 after meeting at McDonald's where Dave was a manager and Amanda was working at the time. They're the parents to a seven-year-old Dylan and were married on June 22, 2012. Their family also includes children from previous relationships, Gavin Berge, 15, Madison Berge, 13, Cameron Wolf, 12, and Landon Berge, 11. Navigating life as a blended family is what inspired their vlog's name, the Berge Blender. In fact, the vlog has become so meaningful that Dave had an image of a blender tattooed on his forearm. There it is, right there. Dave is the vlog's primary recorder on his iPhone 6S, but Amanda also steps in to film certain events throughout the day. A per usual, that's a, that's a weird word, a, a parasol, a, a per, a, anyway, of their unscripted episode reveals the day in the life, philosophy behind the videos. Many shots take place in the family van as kids are ferried to the dentist appointments or home from track meets. A recent video featured a trip to the hall diner where afterward, hold on, hold on, there's more. Where is it? Three, one, two, oh, found it. Where afterward, Dylan rated his breakfast two thumbs up. Last Monday's seg segment even made mention of the Finger Lakes Times photo shoot, chronicling Dave's tongue-in-cheek worries about how his hair looked and his multiple shirt changes. When Dave asked his daughter what she thought of the photo shoot session, her response was a was classic teenager. It was basic. The children have gotten so used to being recorded, they barely notice it anymore. Amanda and Dave say still, if they're having a bad day or don't wish to be filmed, their parents respect those desires. Each night after the kids are in bed, Dave compiles the day's video snippets into an episode and uploads it to YouTube the next morning before heading to work. The process takes anywhere from an hour to 90 minutes. I've gotten much faster at it now, he said. Episode 51, titled Near Death Experience, documents a hike in Conklin Gully in Naples and has garnered the most views. Each episode ranges in length from 7 to 15 minutes and often includes a joke of the day or a riddle. Each also ends with the saying, hey, Blender Blades, hit the puree button and keep on blending. Amanda explained the message reflects that life isn't always perfect and has plenty of chunks along the way, so keep on pur pureeing them until they're smooth. The family also does Facebook Live segments every Thursday, the one called The Blendies, their own ceremony based on the Oscars, log more than 1,500 views. Dave said he tries to keep the content PG and shies away from political or religious subjects. He also tries not to sugarcoat the challenges of raising five children. We're not a perfect family, he said. People get grounded, phones get taken away. Still, it's clear the vlog is more from a collection of home videos shared on YouTube to an inspired common family activity. We do it as a team, said Amanda, adding the family brainstorms ideas together and consequently now finds more time to be together. Before the Bergie Blender, Dave said he would get home from work, take the kids to their sporting events, come home, watch television, and go to bed. Now it's all family all the time because we want to produce something every day, he said. Amanda believes the videos show it's possible to happily raise five children in a blended family, and Dave is proud of the channel's family-oriented bent. They say some viewers have told them that the videos have pushed them to do more with their own children. When one person comes up to you and says, I've been watching your videos, it's good to hear, Dave said. Among those viewers are Wanda Gallagher and her daughter, Shannon. Gallagher 
got to know the Bergies last year when she was a teaching assistant in Dylan's kindergarten class at West Street Elementary School. He would talk about their YouTube show and channel, and I said, what are you talking about? Gallagher recalled. One evening, she and her daughter Shannon searched out the channel and liked what they found. Now watching the Bergie Blender has become a nightly ritual for, for mother and daughter. We use it as our no-brainer no time, Gallagher said. It's a good way to end the night on a good note. Gallagher, Gallagher said she enjoys the Bergie family's sense of humor and realness. It's the reality, it's their life, Gallagher said. It's like, wow, somebody else is running their kids all over the place. Although Dylan, the youngest Bergie, said the goal of the vlog... <laughs> is to get viral his parents are content to have a motivating influence on their watchers and the more people that are motivated by it the better amanda said it's been an interesting ride that's for sure how exciting have you subscribed yet do you want to be on this crazy roller coaster let's go look at, i'm honestly a little teary-eyed this doesn't happen to me very often we are on our way to walmart we are building something who's excited i think i am you think you are Cameron's excited. Dylan's really, really excited. He chose not to come with us. So, you will all find out what we are building. We are getting ready to build a massive slip and slide. Right, Dilly? We'll have 20 feet. Um, might even be longer. Depends. We'll have to see. <laughs> Get your pants, get your shorts wet. Turn around. Turn around, Landon. How are you going on your bot? Okay, hey. make sure the tarp's nice and wet. Down here is fine. I just want to make sure up there is good. good. Oh, All right. Baby so water here. All the soap went down there. It's fine. Whoa! There's tons up here. My pants are all soapy. Oh, let's see if I can make it up. Lay it up. Maddie, you gonna go for it? Yeah. You're wearing shorts and a t shirt? Why don't you? I take the shorts off. All right, move, Dill. Oh. Sissy, you're not wet. <laughs> Is this coming in? <coughs> I guess. Oh, God. I'm so nervous. It's going to be so Just cold. Back up before you run. No, it's not really that cold. So you can run for faster. I've been in it like two, four times. Okay, go for it, girlfriend. Stop. I'm doing it on my belly. You got to fix that tarp down there, honey. Cam, your turn. No, go. Go ahead. Here's one, go. Watch out! I'm going! I'm standing in the top! Go for it, dude. I don't know. Come on, Cam. Just do it. I don't know. It's fun. They're having fun. Do it for the money. Go for it. From like four steps. Go, Cam. What? Cam is on just like. <laughs> well, it's because. But, it's because he's not wet. Oh, it's good. That hurt my leg. Damn it. Thank you. Are you leaving? Uh, in like five minutes. Well, yeah, bye. Go, Can you see this? Have fun. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I think we're good. Yeah, Who's going for? Ready? Quiet, Dilly. Ready for the second one? Maddie, move. That's good, honey. Oh. <laughs> Wait, me, me and Maddie have to go no, on it. together. 
No, nope, because then Dylan can bring his up. <coughs> okay, go. Yep. Give that to Sissy. And then you take Landon's. Kids are outside playing a very quiet game of kickball, so we don't make the neighbor mad. <laughs> there's other there's other kids too outside on the other side of the street playing well, kickball, and they're being pretty loud. This is such a rambunctious street. Crazy me decided to bring Gavin and his two friends to Walmart. Lucky me, they're worse than the younger ones. Let's see where these boys are. Because he's not all hyper and running people over. <clears throat> you want to just get mint, Gavin? Yeah. No, thin mints. Thin mints. Thin mints. Why do you get the thin This is what it's like taking a matter. bunch of teenagers to Walmart. You literally right. get less of an Oreo. On to drinks. So over Bro, you pop a couple of these Mellies, yeah, you'll be done for the night, literally. <laughs> I just, I want to be able to sum up how I feel about the newspaper and the vlog. And I, I had the time of my life, and I never felt this once before. Yes, I swear, it's the truth. And I owe it all to you I had the time of my life And I owe it all to you The time of my life I have felt this way before And I swear it's the truth And I owe it all to you I had the time of my life I've never felt this way before I swear it's the truth And I don't know the words to this song But I thought it'd be a cute little segment for the Berkey Blender You know, so it has to happen sometimes Time for the London Berkey. Don't go Dunder. What do you call a window that a a wrapping window? Yeah. Yeah. What do you call a window that wraps? I don't know what. Two panes. Because <laughs> wow. there's like two panes on the. They're like two chains or whatever his name is, like the rapper, but two panes. Chains the rapper. Sorry, you're like, you said the rapper, so I didn't even know. I'm hilarious. I'll be here all night. Thank you, sir. Words can't really express the excitement I was able to feel today while reading the newspaper with a picture of myself and my family in it. It was very exciting. I may have overlooked something, though. I would just like to take a minute to thank uh susan porter the uh reporter who who did the story I'd like to thank her and spencer Tolis who took the uh the, the photographs yes, they're you. fantastic the story was fantastic so thank you to you guys for for helping us uh spread our dream so it's it's appreciated yes very much so thank you and until tomorrow blender blades like the paper says hit the puree button and keep on blending. Now the whole world knows, or at least like the Finger Lakes and anybody who subscribes to the Finger Lakes time. So True story. It's like the whole world pretty much. <laughs> Cam drop. Oh, I missed it.